पीपल इन डेली आर सिक रीजन डेली इज पोल्यूटेड एयर After a brief respite from light rain, Diwali fireworks turned Delhi NCR into a gas chamber once again. Despite bans on firework and grab restrictions on traffic and construction, the situation is worsening. In view of the deteriorating conditions, experts have suggested one solution: artificial rain. Following this the Delhi government discussed a plan to carry out artificial rain in Delhi in collaboration with a team from IIT Kanpur to combat air pollution Subsequently the Delhi government submitted a report to the Supreme Court The Supreme Court sternly reprimanded the government making it clear that the responsibility for areas where stubble burning occurs lies with the local police officials The court also warned that if the effective measures were not taken to curb pollution it would take strict action As per the report submitted by the Delhi government the entire cost of artificial rain in Delhi will be borne by the state government Chief Minister Kejriwal stated that if the central government cooperates the first artificial rain could be conducted in Delhi by November 20 Chemical agents such as silver iodine and a solution of dry ice are dispersed through an aircraft a technique known as cloud seeding For this process the selection of clouds is crucial The chosen clouds must contain sufficient liquid during the winter as clouds during the winter may not have enough water. According to scientists, the presence of natural clouds is essential for this process. Recently, IIT Kanpur conducted a trial of this rain using a small aircraft. Some clouds resulted in rain while others experienced light drizzle. However, it is not yet certain how much artificial rain can reduce pollution. ये क्लाउड सीडिंग के द्वारा जो बारिश होती है वो पानी जब बरसता है तो कुछ समय जो डस्ट के पार्टिकल हवा में होते हैं वो नीचे बह जाते हैं पानी के साथ तो उस समय वातावरण अच्छा प्रदूषण से रहित हो जाता है लेकिन जब तक हम प्रदूषण के सोर्सेस पे कुछ अपना एक्शन नहीं लेंगे तब तक प्रदूषण फिर हो जाएगा This method has been used in several countries worldwide including Australia, Japan, Ethiopia, Dubai, Zimbabwe, China, America and Russia. China utilized artificial rain in 2008 to tackle pollution before the Winter Olympic Games in Beijing. Israel regularly engages in artificial rain due to low natural rainfall. In India, Tamil Nadu experimented with this in the 1970s and Karnataka and Tamil Nadu used cloud seeding technology in 1993 and 94. The Karnataka government also employed artificial rain in 2003 and 2004.